How's it going, comic book fans? Welcome back to Comic Drops. So the other day, I received a comment on my video about the prequel to Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees. It said, do you have any recommendations for similar comics while we wait on the prequel? Well, as a matter of fact, I do. If you've just finished reading Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees and are looking for something equally thrilling, creepy, or thought-provoking to dive into, I have scoured my comic book knowledge to find just what you're looking for. Today, we're going to explore five other comics that fans of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees would love. So let's get started. Stray Dogs, written by Tony Fleece and illustrated by Trish Forstner, is a unique blend of horror and animation style art, reminiscent of classic animated films. The story begins with Sophie, a small dog who finds herself in a strange house with a group of other dogs. None of them remember how they got there, but they all share one common trait. They were all pets of the same man. The cozy house hides a dark secret, and as Sophie begins to piece together her fragmented memories, she realizes that her owner might be far more sinister than he appears. Set in a secluded house in the woods, the dogs must uncover the truth about their past and what really happened to their previous owners. The narrative is filled with suspense, dread, and a touch of humor, drawing readers into a tale of survival and friendship in the face of unspeakable evil. The contrast between the cute Disney-esque art style and the dark storyline creates a dissonance that amplifies the horror elements, making the experience all the more unsettling. For fans of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees, Stray Dogs offers a similar atmosphere of hidden darkness and unexpected twists. The combination of innocence betrayed and the slow reveal of a sinister plot aligns perfectly with the tone of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees, making it a must-read for those who enjoyed the psychological horror and tension of that original series. Beautiful Darkness, written by Fabian Vellman and illustrated by Kariscoat, is a haunting fairy tale with a grotesque twist. The story unfolds in a forest where a group of tiny, childlike creatures emerges from the corpse of a young girl. As these beings try to survive in the wilderness, their true, darker natures begin to surface. What starts as a whimsical adventure quickly devolves into a harrowing tale of cruelty, survival, and the loss of innocence. The setting, a seemingly serene forest, becomes a stage for the macabre, as the characters' actions reveal the darker side of human nature. Themes of survival, the breakdown of society, and the inherent brutality of nature are explored in a way that is both beautiful and horrifying. The juxtaposition of the story's grim content with the delicate, almost whimsical art style enhances the overall impact, making readers question the nature of innocence and evil. Fans of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees will appreciate beautiful darkness for its exploration of the sinister aspects lurking beneath a seemingly peaceful surface. Both stories use a deceptively gentle aesthetic to cloak their dark narratives, creating a similar sense of unease and fascination for the reader. Written by Alan Moore and illustrated by Eddie Campbell, From Hell is a graphic novel that delves into the infamous Jack the Ripper murders in Victorian London. This detailed and meticulously researched narrative doesn't just recount the murders. It explores the social, political, and psychological environment of the time. Moore presents a theory on the identity and motivations of the Ripper, while also exploring the broader implications of his crimes on society and history as a whole. The story takes readers through the grim streets of London, where darkness lurks in every alley, and the line between reality and madness is thin. Moore's writing is dense, filled with historical references and layered meanings, while Campbell's stark black and white art adds to the oppressive and unsettling atmosphere. The graphic novel addresses themes such as power, corruption, insanity, and the human capacity for violence. From Hell is a perfect follow-up for fans of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees, who enjoy a blend of historical fiction and horror. Both works offer deep dives into the psychology of their characters, exploring how personal demons and societal pressures can lead to acts of unspeakable violence. The dark, immersive atmospheres and the focus on hidden truths make From Hell a compelling read for those who have enjoyed the nuanced storytelling of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees. 
Harrow County, written by Colin Bunn with art by Tyler Crook, is a southern gothic horror series that tells the story of Emmy, a young girl living in a remote country area with a dark and sinister past. As Emmy nears her 18th birthday, she begins to experience strange occurrences and discover unsettling truths about her lineage. The woods surrounding her home are filled with spirits, haunts, and creatures that both terrify and fascinate her. Set against the backdrop of a haunted rural landscape, Harrow County combines folklore, horror, and coming-of-age themes. The story explores Emmy's journey as she grapples with her identity and the dark legacy that seems to await her. Crook's watercolor-style art adds an ethereal, almost haunting quality to the story, making the supernatural elements feel both beautiful and terrifying. For fans of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees, Harrow County offers a similar exploration of dark secrets hidden in a seemingly tranquil environment. The slow burn horror, combined with richly developed characters and a deep sense of place, make Harrow County an excellent choice for those looking to explore more eerie and atmospheric narratives. Written by Joshua Williamson with art by Mike Henderson, Nellbiter is a psychological horror comic series set in the eerie town of Buckaroo, Oregon, known for being the birthplace of 16 of the world's most notorious serial killers. The story follows Nicholas Finch, an investigator who travels to Buckaroo to uncover the mystery behind the town's dark history and the origin of its serial killers, known as the Buckaroo Butchers. The narrative explores themes of nature versus nurture, questioning whether the town is inherently evil or if there's something more sinister influencing its residents. The series is filled with tension and suspense, blending detective noir with horror elements as Finch navigates a web of secrets and danger, trying to piece together the clues that would explain why this town produces so many killers. Each issue delves deeper into the psyche of both the killers and the citizens, creating a compelling and unsettling atmosphere. Fans of Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees will enjoy Nailbiter for its dark, twisted narrative and focus on psychological horror. Both series are great at creating a sense of dread and paranoia, exploring how ordinary people can harbor dark secrets and be pushed to their limits. The small town setting and its hidden horrors are central to both stories, making Nailbiter a perfect follow-up read. So that wraps up this video on Comic Drops. Five great comic series to check out if you love Beneath the Trees Where Nobody Sees. Each of these comics offers a unique blend of horror, mystery, and dark intrigue, perfect for readers who enjoy uncovering the secrets hidden beneath the surface. If you have any other recommendations or thoughts on these titles, please let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more great comic content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Comic Drops.